Hey guys, it's Teja here and in this video, I'm going to teach you how to dual boot Remix OS on your PC. Before getting started, let's discuss why you should install Remix OS on your PC. Remix OS works on all computers, even on the computers with low processor. Therefore, you can run Remix OS on computers which can't run advanced operating systems. Remix OS is also comparatively very faster than other app players like Bluestacks, Noxplayer, etc. So you can run your favorite Android apps on Remix OS faster. Without further ado, let's get started. So first you have to create a partition on your hard disk so that Remix OS can be installed. To do that, simply open your file explorer and right click on this PC and select manage. Now you will see a computer management window like this. Now simply double click on disk management under storage. So here you will see all the partitions which are already created on your hard disk. Now what you have to do is right click on system drive that is where the windows OS is installed and select shrink volume and wait for some time. Now you will see a window like this where you have to enter the amount of space you want to allocate to Remix OS on your hard disk. So it is recommended that you at least give a uh, 8 GB or more space. So in this video I will be giving 15 GB. So I will be entering here 15360 which represents 15 GB. Finally click on shrink. Once the process is done you will see an unallocated space like this. So simply right click on the unallocated space and select new simple volume. And here you will see a new simple volume wizard like this. Simply click on next here and leave this thing default. Don't make any changes and click on next. And here select assign the following drive letter and from this select the desired letter. For example, I'll be selecting G there. In the next window, make sure that you select the file system as FAT32 and uh, come down to volume label and here in the volume label give a name something like remix os for example and finally click on next and then finish now this is going to create a new simple volume for you so this is the partition that we have created now the next thing is to download the uh, Remix OS ISO image file from the internet. So here is the official website to download it. This link will be in the description below. So go check the description. Now once you come in here, you just click on the download now button. And then uh, it shows you the recommended system uh, requirements. Uh, as you can see, it requires 2 GHz dual core processor or better and 2 GB system memory, minimum 8 GB of free hard drive space and it says internet access is so if you don't know whether to download the 64 bit version or the 32 bit version simply follow me open the file explorer and right click on this pc and select properties now in this window beside system type you will see which processor your device has so if you can see here in my case i have a 64 based processor so this means that i will be able to run the 64 bit version of remix os on my pc so Based on this, you can decide whether to download the 32-bit version or the 64-bit version. So one more thing is that here it says the 64-bit version is compatible with both UEFI boot and legacy BIOS. Whereas the 32-bit version is only compatible with the legacy BIOS. So you have to keep this in mind. So you can simply download this using the torrent by clicking on the torrent download button and then you can download this using any of your torrent clients. So once the download is done, here is how the downloaded file is gonna look like. It's actually a zip file, so you can use any of the software like WinZip or 7-Zip to extract uh, this file. I'll be using 7-Zip here. Once the extraction is done, open the extracted folder and you will find four files in that folder. Now this file is actually the ISO image file and this file is the PC installation tool for Remix OS. Now what you have to do is you have to double click on the PC installation tool for Remix OS and then grant it the administrative rights.
and then you're gonna see a window like this in this window you have to mention or specify the ISO image file of the remix OS you can do that by simply clicking on this browse button and then locate the downloaded ISO image file of remix OS which is uh, on the desktop in my case and then select hard disk from this drop down menu and in the drive select the drive letter of the remix os partition which in my case is g as you can see here so once you have done that simply click on the ok button and remix os is going to get installed on your partition Finally click on the reboot now button and your computer should restart. So in the Windows bootloader you will see two options whether to boot from Windows 10 or to boot from Remix OS. So simply select Remix OS from this and hit enter. Now if at all you see any error like this like as I am seeing now then you have to go to your boot, boot device options. So you can go that go to there by tapping on the escape key however this may vary for you so you, you might have to google it. So go to boot device options and here select boot from EFI file and select the first option no volume label and then go to EFI and come down to Remix OS and then come down and select drop x64.efi So here you will see three options Windows, Remix OS and Remix OS advanced options. So simply select Remix OS from this list and hit enter and there we go Android X86 loads up like this and here is our Remix OS and we are now successfully able to boot Remix OS alongside any Windows operating system now if this is the first boot, I mean if this is the first time you are running Remix OS on your hard disk then this process, this boot is going to take a very long time. So it may take 1 hour, 2 hours or any time. Uh, the basic thing behind this is uh, Remix OS is actually getting installed on your hard disk and that's why this is going to take a lot of time if this is the first time you are using Remix OS. So simply be patient and wait for the installation of Remix OS to be done and your Remix OS should work fine once the process is done. Hit the subscribe button for more videos. Like my Facebook page at facebook.com slash techrosh156. Follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash techrosh156. Visit my website at techrosh156.com. Thanks for watching. Cheers.